vehicles. I'm told the Jeep Grand Cherokee was chosen because of its classic style, but it's interesting. You don't usually see EV SUVs out there on the road. A lot of the larger companies, almost all the larger companies, have some electric on their roadmap, but invariably they're all very small cars. Founder and president of AMP Electric Vehicles, Steve Burns, is breaking the mold, he says. Instead of building new vehicles from the ground up, they do what he calls a heart transplant. We try to keep as much of the existing car as possible. So we only have to, you know, so we, we drop the engine out, we put ours in, it bolts into the same bolts that used to hold the gas engine. Today it was announced that a Cincinnati dealer is the first to sell the electric vehicles starting today. But the goal is to keep growing throughout the state, including Toledo. Introductory price for the SUV, 57400 but it means no emissions. It pays itself back in five years, so that's kind of a magic threshold to get to. Um, so with the rebate, we're under 50000 So if you like the idea of going green and you love SUVs, this may be an option for you. On the scene from the North American International Auto Show in Detroit, Allison Brown, Fox, Toledo News.